As I'm recording this on Thursday afternoon, we've just got the news that Governor Inslee is ordering all public and private schools to shut down until April 24th. That's six weeks. That's some rough news. Uh, between this and most events around town being canceled, this is going to hit most of us in the pocketbook in a serious way. So with all this bad news and uncertainty right now, we want to try to find the good and positive in our current situation by providing you with some suggestions for fun things to do at home while self-quarantining. Thanks for joining us for West Seattle Daily, episode number 45, brought to you by Seatown Real Estate, West Seattle's only indie community real estate brokerage. I'm your host, Christian Harris. Trying to look on the bright side of this, many of us are too busy to spend the quality time with our families that we often want to. And even though school events and meetings are being canceled, we don't have to feel like life itself is being canceled. Try some of these fun activities around the house. Dust off those board games and have some good old fashioned fun. Try to avoid the temptation of binge watching Netflix and spend some time instead reading a good book that's been sitting on your to read pile for many years. Maybe that's just me. Maybe that's just my problem. I'm sure all of you read plenty of books. Go to the park or go outside. Try going on a new hike, mountain biking, or even skiing. You're outside and often separated by significant distance from others, making this a low-risk contagion activity. Find a put-together puzzle. Cook a new recipe as a family. Try to use up these old ingredients in the fridge, bake banana bread, or maybe some chocolate chip cookies. This would be a fun time to learn something new as a family. Google or your smart speaker may become your new best friend. Arts and crafts, macrame, painting, creating something 3D with a glue gun, this is a time to get in touch with your creative side. Listen to a podcast, like the Seatown Podcast. You may be staying home, but doesn't mean you can't hear the stories of your favorite businesses and personalities of West Seattle. You can visit us at www.seatownpodcast.com. Don't forget the dash between the C and the town. Find new music to play in the background while you're doing these activities. Don't forget to keep eating a healthy diet with lots of antioxidants and maybe even take an afternoon nap to help keep your immune system kicking. What do you like to do to keep yourself busy and productive at home? Thanks for tuning in. Make the best of this weekend and catch you on Monday.